I said we ain't gonna cry We ain't gonna cry no more One of these old days Okay, all praises and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushua by Hashem Rakhakadash. The honors to the elders, apostles, a great millstone, and also um, Shalom to the Akim sincerely in the faith of Yahweh by Hashem Yahushua. My name is Lamadia, and um, I'm back again to um, comment on Captain Tazaryak video. On on a statement he he made about John the Baptist questioning Yahweh Shah, already knowing that that was Yahweh Shah. So based off his logic, he's saying that John the Baptist was fell out the truth because he was questioning Yahweh Shah, so he he lost the faith. Now, so based off that logic. Now, my question to Captain Tazaryak is, did Yahweh Shah fall out the truth? Because in um, Matthew 27 chapter, in the 46th verse, Yahweh Shah questioned the Most High. So now, are you saying that Yahweh Shah fell out the truth? And I read it and it says, um, Matthew 27, 46, and about that, and about the ninth hour, Yahweh Shah cried with a loud voice, saying, "Eli, Eli, lama sabachthani." Well, that's all English um, translation of how to sound the actual Hebrew word. That's not actually um, the Hebrew word. But anyone read on says, "That is to say, my power, my power. Why hast thou forsaken me?" And, and that's coming out um, the words of Yahweh Shah. And he was talking towards the Most High. So Yahweh Shah was que questioning the Most High. The Most High. So what, what are you going to say? Yahweh Shah fell out the truth? Because that's pretty much what is being said based off the logic that John the Baptist fell out the truth because he questioned Yahweh Shah. See, they, what they're trying to do is make first grade math, high school math. It's not that it's not that difficult. It's still one plus one. And this is why we're making these videos to com combat the bullshit that they're teaching. Because the real men of the Lord, they role is to knock down anything that's contrary to the truth. And, and since I said that, let's go to 1 Corinthians, the fourth chapter. Um, excuse me. 1 Corinthians, the fourth chapter, not Romans. And it reads, 1 Corinthians 4, 1. Let a man so account of us as the ministers of Yahweh Shah. Now, a minister is a person that um, do service. So... We're servants unto Yahweh Shabbos, which make us ministers. And stewards of the mysteries of the Most High. What are the mysteries of the Most High? The scriptures. Because the mysteries of the Most High or the scriptures is not open or revealed unto everybody. And for you to understand and break down and, the, and decode the scriptures, the first thing that must happen is the spirit of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shab must be working along with you. But it's obvious in this case the spirit of Shatan or Satan is working through these guys to, to teach that Yahweh um that John the Baptist was not a man of the Lord. That's the spirit that's on them. And the word steward, the word steward, you break it down. The word steward steward means house guardian. And that's what we are. We're the steward of the house of the of the um the Most High, because when you go to the scriptures, it references the the members of the elect as being a house, and Yahweh Shah, he's the foundation or the cornerstone of that house, and we're a guardian unto that house, meaning we're protecting that house. And what are we protecting the house from? 
from the lies because the the lies are trying the lies is trying to dis, destruct the house of Yahweh Shah. So we come back in these lies with the truth. So with that, I'm gonna close until next time. And again, all praises and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah Shalom.